Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Surviving Mars. This is the 1075% difficulty playthrough. Now we've recently just started up the mystery, the wildfire mystery, it turns out. Which is kind of topical since it's a pandemic. <clears throat> In this case, an interplanetary one. Anyway, um, I don't remember exactly what I was doing last time around. It's been a little while since I uh, recorded a, an episode. But uh, we have a uh, rocket that's... Uh, uh, we have two rockets that are basically just both filled up with rare metals. Which, uh, once they're uh, both refueled, I'll send them back to Earth. And we'll get the uh, exports, right? Um, but meanwhile, uh, we've been dealing with the uh, uh, renegades, uh, and that's going to help the colony. And since our birth rate is way up due to the hanging garden, which we got uh, a, a prefab for. Uh, so while that's going on, uh, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to uh, start rejiggering my um, population. In particular, I'm going to move the uh, nurseries over over into this dome. I'm going to set up a playground or so. Um, meanwhile, we've got um, uh, we've got a we got metal mining up uh, last time. Uh, because our uh, metal collection is getting low, so hopefully that um, that catches up the uh, uh, metals demand. Uh, and uh, research, we're working on uh, Martian diet, which will cut the food demand for the uh, uh, for the colonists. And then we've got deep water and deep metal extraction coming up. Now the reason for that is, uh, well, we've got this deep water here, uh, which uh, will be very useful to be able to exploit uh, when uh, this one runs out. Yeah, uh, because it's just about run out. Uh, but I think before I start messing with the domes, I need to uh, rejigger the, uh, the water supply. Uh, so uh, let's just take a look in these. Uh, we're producing um, nothing, so uh, we're only uh, drawing that down during storms. What I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to set up a couple more uh, water tanks. Uh, now, the... Uh, the reason for that, of course, is, uh, well, uh, it just seems like a good idea. Uh, so I'm going to do that right away. Uh, well, let's, uh, let's start the clock first. Okay, so it's under here, and it's going to be under here. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, stick up a couple water tanks. I don't know, we'll stick them over here. Uh, yeah, that. No. Where's the uh, subsurface heater? It's up here. Uh, so, probably... Uh, probably stick a couple of them up here. Um, and maybe over here. Oh, I can fit one in here, and uh, here. Yeah, so I'll, I'll do that. Now, whoops. Uh, okay, so uh, these rockets, they're uh, still filling up. Okay, uh, so what I was going to do... I was going to uh, go in here, and I'm going to put up several nurseries in here, and I'm going to put them in this uh, this uh, triangle here. 
I'm going to put them here. Um, I'm also going to put... Um, I'm going to put a couple of playgrounds up. Uh, okay, yeah, we're, so we're we're losing colonists due to wildfire. Um, so I'm going to put uh, uh, a couple of playgrounds in. Um, and I'm going to put... Uh, I'm going to put an apartment complex in here. Uh, ooh, that one looks uh, exciting. So I'll put that in there. Okay. So doing that should allow... Whoops. Uh, I keep pressing escape to uh, undo things, and that's just the wrong thing to do, right? Uh, so that should mean, like, once those come up, I can demolish the uh, nurseries over here. And uh, that should allow uh, a... Uh, a slight improvement in uh, uh, child uh, behavior or operations or something. Um, we've got a lot of youth coming up, so food st shortage. That's oh yeah, that's over there in the kill them off dome. Um, yeah, that's my strategy for getting rid of uh, renegades and idiots. Idiots are useless because they break things. And renegades, while they aren't as useless, they do steal things and break things as well. So. Okay. And, yeah, that's just those guys in there. And there's just two in here, so... Um, yeah, so those will eventually, uh, uh, go away. And they can, uh, they can get busy, uh, starving, that's fine. Um, okay, that one has, uh, completed... Um... Uh, I am going to need to put in uh, at least some sort of an amenity here. Uh, so, dome services. I think if we put in a uh, grocer, that might not be a, a bad idea either. Um, yeah, we'll put a grocer in as well. Um, right, that will, uh, okay, so that will get some, uh, some stuff, uh, operating. Now, that's a nursery, and we'll get rid of it. <clears throat> that's a space bar. Um, that is a nursery, we'll get rid of it. And then we'll go in here. Um, okay, now let's uh, up the tempo a bit here, and then we'll see if we get, uh, get the, uh, the children, uh, moving domes. I don't think we will, uh, but if I, uh, go in here... And I go age group, and I go child, uh, apply it. Um, we should get all the children in here, uh, theoretically. Yeah, eight there, one there. Okay, and then they, they can avail themselves of the uh, playground, and that... Uh, Okay, now let's uh, take a look in here. Uh, we are, uh, of course, um, you know, running the uh, the university there. 
what we should probably do here is run that for all three shifts. Um, yep. Uh, okay. And those are doing their thing. Um, we're training geologists. Uh, that's not a bad thing. Uh, we lost an infected colonist in the... <laughs> Uh, wait, what colonists? Um, why is there seven colonists in there? Who are they? Okay, well... Okay, well, um, we have, infected, um, what, okay, let's just go in here and check flaws, renegade idiot, okay. back. Okay, and what about this one? Flaws. Idiot. Okay. Why is the... Okay, let's just go in here. Age group. No children there. Okay, now. Um, right. Yeah, we don't want the children in there. Uh, that would be bad. Um, okay. Now. And you are... A renegade. Okay, that one can be there. Now. Okay. Um, right. Okay, so we've got uh, 15 children, 13 youth. Wow. Uh, so our... Uh, population should be going up. Now, do we have anybody living in here? We do. Okay. Now, let's uh, check in on our rockets. Yeah, we don't have the uh, rare metals full yet, so there's that. Now, something we're going to need to do is... Uh, uh, with the uh, wildfire mystery, we're going to have to be able to grow the cure, which is uh, known as cure tatoes. And those things are absolutely brutal on the, uh, on the soil. So we're going to need to have uh, farms to grow those in. Actual farms, I think. And uh, that's going to be really annoying. So we're going to uh, need to get a uh, farming operation up and running. But I'm going to do that once the uh, number of uh, jobs that are waiting for people goes down. Because so we're going to need uh, three, or, three or four farms, I think, to, uh, to keep, keep up with that. So uh, that's going to be... Uh, well, it's just going to be uh, it, yeah, annoying. Um, starving colonists, too. We have three colonists in here. Oh, those will be renegades, right? Two renegades. We have a cold wave coming. Um, you are... You're a renegade. You are 
An idiot. Okay. We got two renegades and an idiot in there. Okay. Well, that's uh, perfectly fine. Cold wave. Okay. What I should do then... Um, okay, metals are actually going up, so that's good. Um, what I should do is... Uh, where is it? A subsurface heater. Well, I've got a subsurface heater there. Um, I think perhaps... Yeah, that should be fine. Ah, uh, I probably want to get another one over here. Okay, we've completed Martian diet, uh, so that's good. Uh, we're 60% uh, through deep water. Uh, right. Um, okay. Okay, this is uh, online. We'll uh, increase the surface area that it covers up like about there. Um, right. Um, good. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, we're down a fair chunk of metals there. Uh, so I'm going to have to go and uh, exploit, say, this metal deposit uh, at some point. Maybe this one. Uh, and that's going to be annoying because we don't have autonomous extractors. Um, on the other hand, if I chuck up a couple more of these metal extractors, that nano... Um, that uh, uh, um, this one here, nano refinement, that one uh, could be quite uh, quite uh, beneficial uh, because it means that we uh, we continue to uh, uh, extract uh, uh, resources even after the deposits exhausted. Um, yeah, I'm going to finish out rover printing. Uh, okay, now you have 27, you have 29, so we're one short of a full load there. Now over here we have we have 13 geologists. Okay, so uh, what do we have working here? We have geologists working in the uh, in the mine. That's uh, kind of good. Uh, now, uh, what uh, what I want to do is go in here, and uh, we will uh, train automatic now. Okay. We need engineers. We need some geologists. Yeah, engineers is what we really need. Uh, okay, so... Uh, we've got a cold wave coming. Where's the... Uh, okay, are you on? Turned on. Are you on? Turned on. Yes. Good. Okay. So far, so good. Metals are going up. Oh! Uh, the worst has happened. Wildfire has infected Earth. Uh, right. Um... Okay, well, uh, let's go in here. We don't have the uh, research to find the uh, wildfire cure yet. 
Okay, so we're still on the uh, waiting game. Um, right, are you... Okay. Uh, I just want to get the... Uh, I want to get this last batch of exports through. Uh, I want to have uh, a little bit of uh, cash, just in case an event comes up that benefits from it. Um... Right. Uh, okay, we have two renegades. Right, we have some vacant work slots. Um, right. Well, um, we definitely have uh, food production is uh, sufficient uh, for the moment. Um, oh look, the drones are busy because they have to, uh, uh, you know, do the food thing, unloading the, uh, ranch. Um, right. Um. Oh, right, that's, uh, only working the, uh, the one shift. Uh, okay, so our uh, youngins are coming up into the uh, uh, workforce. So our uh, empty work slot should start going down uh, relatively rapidly. Um, as the, uh, the children get older. Now we are, of course, cannibalizing some of our workforce with the university. That's a uh, necessary evil. Uh, now, over here... Uh, we're just about ready to launch this guy. Yep. Launch. Now, this guy needs two more. Okay. Uh, infection level is contained still on Earth. It should be for a moment. Now, do these guys have... Yeah, they do have hi the hygroscopic thing going. Um, okay, this guy can almost launch. Um, total recall. Uh, you are contract contacted by Douglas Quaid. Da 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 da. <laughs> uh, Um, eh, hmm, hmm, yeah, uh, if anyone's not familiar with uh, the Total Recall movie, uh, Douglas Quaid was uh, the uh, uh, protagonist there. Um, we're going to accept the pro a proposal. Uh, okay. Now, the question is, what's at that anomaly? Uh, we can't send an expedition there just yet, but let's just check in here. Um, whoops. Um. Uh, Quaid Expedition takes five crew. Uh, right, okay. Uh, we will probably do the Quaid Expedition, but I have a suspicion we lose the rocket when we do. Uh, which would be slightly inconvenient. Uh, I say, uh, you know. Well, we have our cold wave. Um, okay, now our, we're at night, okay, that's why the uh, power is low. Uh, uh, okay, we have apparently used a bunch of polymers for stuff. Um, 
oh, we have uh, less uh, uh, workforce in there than would be ideal. Uh, that would be why. Um, okay, let's uh, check in in here. Um, possibly our problem is uh, colonists are aging. But we have 16 children coming along. Uh, we're down to 16 Earthborn. Um, yeah, so, uh, so I guess, uh, I guess it's a matter of, uh, waiting some stuff out here. Uh, the Cold Wave has four sol, four and a half, well, almost five sols remaining. Um, right. So how's, uh, how's this guy doing now? Well, if we can get uh, get some engineers trained, that will uh, solve a lot of that, I think. Um, right. Now, are these guys... They're producing some water. Uh, okay. Uh, right. Now during the okay yeah we've got uh, positive power during the day here so we're okay uh, for the moment. Um, let's turn off the uh, the security station. We don't need it. Um, right. Okay. Now. Um, You are fully loaded, so you can head off to Earth. Good. Uh, so that, I think, will be our last uh, set of export rockets. I think. Uh, polymers... Yeah. It's... Uh, dicey. Yeah. Well, hopefully polymer starts going up. I might have to uh, increase the uh, 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 priority of the polymers uh, um, factory. Whoops. Um, or maybe more people are coming into there. Oh, we've got engineers coming in. Okay, we've got engineers coming in. Good, that's going to sort itself out now. Uh, good. Because uh, we're up to six now. Uh, yeah, we should be, we should be good. Uh, the building's filling up. Um, okay, so that's, uh, that's because we have, uh, more people coming into the workforce. Uh, we're gonna have a lot of people dropping out of the workforce soon. And that's definitely going to be an issue. Uh, but, uh, that's, that is what it is. Uh, if we can keep our number of renegades down, we'll be okay. Uh, we're three quarters to Earth on our first export rocket. And when the rocket comes back, we'll, uh, send our geologists up to do that, uh, breakthrough. Uh, just because, uh, I want to know what it is. And, uh, if it's the one I think it might be, uh, it'll be uh, really, really good. Um, now, I'm under no illusions that it is, but, uh, you know, it would be kind of cool if it is. Um, right. So we got 12% left on deep water extraction, uh, which is... Uh, uh, that's an important one. 
Uh, I'm hoping for autonomous extractors. Uh, or uh, Forever Young. Uh, one or the other will be uh, pretty much ideal. Uh, okay, what have we got here? Uh, okay, now we can research the wildfire cure. Okay, now let's go and take a look in here. Wildfire cure is 36,000. What we're going to do is uh, build a uh, infirmary that's in here. Infirmary. Uh, we're going to build one of them here. Yeah. And I think I'll put a second one over here. Um, okay. So we'll see how much those uh, actually reduce the uh, wildfire cure uh, thing. Now let's... Um, Let's go here, and uh, we'll send our cargo rocket back. You know what? We'll send it back empty. Uh, so we've got 800 uh, million there. Um, okay. Now if we do this, and we do this, okay. Uh, now, if we go in here... And that's knocked it down to 27,000. So, you know. Uh, what I'm going to do, though, I'm going to queue this up. And then I'll go and put deep water extraction back at the top. Uh, no. Not, no, no, no. Uh, queue that up. Deep water. We'll put deep water back at the top, and I'll keep rover printing right after the wildfire cure. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, we definitely uh, want to research the cure. Uh, that's uh, definitely a thing we want to do. Uh, now, uh, oh, we've got 19 children now. Uh, okay. Yeah, this is this is good. Our uh, population's going up. Um, yeah, we're down to needing twenty-six um, engineers. Okay. Uh, who died? A renegade. Um, we got a meteor storm coming. Well, that's okay. Uh, are you guys on? Yeah, you guys are on. I have a feeling I probably want a, another one of those things, but... Maybe over here. Uh, do I have the uh, tech for building them? I do. Um, 15 metals and... Uh, yeah. If I uh, chuck one of them over here... Yeah, we'll chuck one of them over there. Uh, that'll give us a little better coverage of the uh, the base. Uh, a meteor storm is uh, is a good thing. Where's the explorer? Oh, it's it's home. Okay. Where's the uh, transport? We the transport got destroyed apparently. That's the explorer. That's the commander. Okay, that's why we want drone printing. Um, okay. Uh, okay, so we got a couple sols until the uh, meteors come. Meteors are good. They may provide uh, resources. What are you? Malfunctioned. Oh. Well, let's just send the commander down there and fix it. That would be good. 
Um, right. Uh, where is it? Oh, it's coming. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, our uh, rocket from Earth is just about here. Or our other rocket to Earth is just about there, rather. Right. Uh, so that'll be another uh, export amount. Okay, we finished deep water extraction. That's good. Uh, now we're working on the wildfire cure, uh, which we can uh, probably finish pretty quickly. Um, okay, you can come back home. Now, is it worth um, building a couple more uh, infirmaries? Uh, you know what? If I these things take ten concrete only, so if I just uh, chuck down a few of them. Yeah, if I do that, and we'll see how fast the uh, the cure comes up. I'm going to demolish them afterward. Uh, it's just... Uh, uh, the... Uh, uh, the... Uh, research is expensive, and uh, I want to avoid... Uh, that taking longer than it needs to because if we go in here yeah we're down to 18,000 now it's uh, another one Okay. Apparently, you can't take it below 50%. Uh, right. Yeah, you can't. Cost reduction, 70%. Okay. Well, uh, now what happens if I turn them off? Okay, now let's uh, go here. It's still, okay. Now what has uh, idle deposits? These guys, right. Let's um, go over here. And uh, we'll chuck a water extractor on here. Okay. And uh, pipes. Uh, pipes. You can go here. And... Uh, Did I just, uh, oh, um, nope, that didn't connect, um, no, uh, get rid of that, uh, right, and get rid of that, and that, okay, now, what I want to do is, uh, nope, actually, yeah, I want to uh, launch the rocket, uh, and I want to go in here and power, uh, power cable, do that. Okay, uh, now uh, put the, 
other water extractor. Like that. Yeah. That way. No. That way. I can connect a pipe to it. Yeah. Okay. So turn that off. Turn that off. Okay. Meteor Storm is uh, operating. Uh, okay. Oh, our uh, concrete here is uh, uh, empty. Uh, okay. Uh, what I'm going to do is uh, land a rocket. Okay. Uh, how's our uh, engineers 22? Yeah. Okay. So our uh, engineering stuff is uh, doing way better. Yeah, we got engineers in there. And we got lots of people that are resembling engineers in there. Uh, we'll go in here and we'll turn off exports. Then we'll go in here and we'll find the uh, breakthrough. Yep, that's the breakthrough. And we'll send the expedition. Okay. Right? So, we're at 11% on the wildfire cure. Okay. Um, how's the metals doing here? Halfway empty. Uh, right. Where is the uh, meteor storm? Oh, it's up there. Okay. Uh, wildfire is now endemic. Grave news. Uh, we have to hurry. Okay. Right? Uh, well, we are researching the cure. So, you know, there is that. Uh, meanwhile, um, what I should do... Oh, the rocket's on its way. Uh, what do we got in here? Uh, uh, we have... Uh, no, no, no. I want this. We have... Three renegades. Okay, what I want to do... Uh, births are not allowed there. What's this? Okay... Well, that was not a terribly useful uh, breakthrough. Uh, I think perhaps uh, investigating Mr. Quaid's uh, uh, operation might be a thing to do. Um, right. Okay, you can land. And uh, what I'll do is... Uh, Send, uh, now we'll go up here. Where's Quaid? This was Quaid, right? Yep. Uh, we'll send that expedition. Just to find out what uh, the Quaid thing is. Okay. And, uh, how are we doing here? Oh, whoa, 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 27? Okay. 
Well, let's um, uh, let's queue up a uh, another nursery over here. Uh, which can go uh, here. Okay. Um, I'm going to find out what the Quaid uh, uh, thing is. And then uh, I'm leaving these uh, extractors here. Uh, because uh, they can uh, extract uh, stuff even without uh, uh, a deposit, right? Uh, and that's uh, that's kind of uh, kind of uh, what I want, right? Um, Right, uh, so the Quaid expedition is uh, on its way. Our rocket from Earth is just about here. Um, wildfire cure is 20% complete. Oh, we've got uh, genius colonists. That's uh, kind of cool. Uh, okay. Uh... Okay. Uh, I'm thinking maybe I shouldn't have done the Quaid expedition. Uh, we'll see. Um, okay, how are we going here? Um, right. Now, what happens if I do this? Um, okay. Science. What's this? Oh, yeah. Uh, this here. Yeah. Okay, this here. Uh, rocket can land. Okay. Um, da, 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 da. What do I want? Metals or rare metals? Metals. Where? question is, where was it uh, revealed? Um, okay. Well, that wasn't a bad uh, result. So I guess, you know, we can survive that. Uh, what I want to uh, turn off exports here. Um, you can land. And... Uh, We'll just go in here. That's new techs, medics, scientists, geologists, resources, botanists, research progress, engineer, research progress. Well, let's start with resources for geologists. Uh, it just seems like an idea to clear the uh, anomalies, uh, just to... Uh, get uh, um, get some stuff here um, okay and uh, that scientist botanist engineer yeah we'll uh, also send the engineers for that okay 
Um, but anyway, uh, uh, what we uh, what we need to do, I think, is get uh, probably another concrete extractor up next time. Uh, Um, oh, we just zapped a meteor. That was okay. Okay, then. Um, well, I'm just going to get rid of these uh, extra infirmaries to get, the, uh, get some of the uh, concrete back. And, uh, no, we'll go in here. Yeah, okay. Um, right. Okay, so that's, um, that's that. Um, the uh, cure is uh, researching. Uh, just like uh, in uh, 2020 here, the cure is taking forever to research. Um, our genius must have gone on the expedition. Uh, I suppose that's fine. Uh, we got 38 polymers. Uh, okay. Uh, right. Uh, yeah, definitely we're, uh, coming up on the, uh, uh, the, uh, the time mark. Uh, I've been running these episodes long because this is going to be a long enough series as it is, and I want to, uh, you know, minimize the uh, number of episodes so this doesn't run for like five years uh, real time. Okay, so if we land the rocket, right, that should get us the... Uh, okay, we've got 2,500 science for that one. Okay, that one lands. Uh, this needs botanists, uh, medics, and scientists. Okay. What do we have? We have medics. And we have no scientists. Okay. Uh, botanist. Medic. New techs. Well, we'll send that expedition. Um, we're going to need uh, scientists and uh, botanists, right? So, yeah, it's, uh, basically it's uh, a bunch of uh, stuff. Maybe we'll reveal something useful. There's not much left to reveal. Uh, as you can see, we've got some text here. Um, interplanetary projects, you know, um, oh, we've already done planetary survey. Okay. And, uh, down we come there. And, uh, send off the, uh, scientist one. I think I'll schedule that one. Uh, which one needs, uh, that's botanists. That's medics. That, okay, that's scientist. Yeah, we'll send off the scientist one. Uh, okay. Uh, so next uh, next episode, I think we'll get a farming operation online. Uh, mostly so that we can get... Uh, so we can uh, be prepared for the uh, wildfire thing. Uh, anyway, uh, and, and that will also cause the uh, university to train some botanists, and I think we probably have uh, the workforce to uh, do that now. Um, yeah, we, I, think, I think we probably do. 
Uh, and then, uh, yeah, I guess, uh, uh, I guess I'll, I'll stop time here. Uh, so I guess, uh, yeah, uh, we're uh, trucking along. Uh, we've got 28 children, 22 youth, so uh, our workforce is going to expand quite a bit uh, in the next uh, a few sols. And that's going to uh, going to make uh, all the difference, I think. Uh, we're uh, coming close to the uh, breakover point, uh, I think. And uh, when we hit that breakover point, well, a whole lot of stuff will uh, will uh, uh, change, right? Uh, and then it'll. It, I'm not sure if I'll play it all the way out to the bitter end uh, uh, for you guys, but once it's clear we've uh, basically won, uh, like absolutely clear, uh, you know, like when we have uh, no resource shortages or chances of that, and we get the uh, major disasters are not happening anymore. Uh, that and the mystery is is resolved either successfully or or we fail uh either way uh you know that's uh, uh I'll, I'll have to think about it when we get closer but uh for the moment uh, uh there's still quite a bit of play left to get there i mean we're at f almost 15 percent temperature uh which uh you know that's good uh, need to get uh, something going for uh, atmosphere. Uh, is if we can get to the point where we can open the domes, a whole lot of stuff gets a whole lot easier. Anyway, uh, that's uh, that's going to be all for this time. So stay healthy. Uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And see you back next time.